All right, some final touches on the frame. Uh, two things I haven't taken off yet is the the two uh, front uh, bumper supports and the cross brace for the transmission. Um, oh, these suckers are tight. So, um, I guess I'll have to just adjust the bumper when it gets there. Um, either way, so it's the angle this way that I need to make sure I make adjustments and then I'll also in and out. So there's this piece here, there's a slot here for this kind of to move around and adjust. So right now it's in it's in the spot where it needs to be. Uh, at least where it was before. So I was hoping to maybe just get a good angle of where it's at because when I take this off it would be clear, you know, where the where it was before. Um so just when I put it back on I just have to make sure that I do it right. Um, so I'm pause it and then uh, keep unscrewing this. All right, it's off, um, and you can see how much play there is. So this is the frame, and here's the piece. So you can see where the bolts were, and you can see where the frame used to sit. So there is, you know, a lot of play this thing can do. Um, and I think there's some measurements on in the manual to tell you the height of the bumper. On, on how that positioned, so that ended up being one of the last things. But once I mount that bumper and mount these, that's, the, that's when we make that decision. Um, and so this one was really tough. I had to really rent. I had to do a double wrench on on this one, almost all the way off. It was just I don't know, but bolt looks looks all right. So I'll de-rust those. Get this cleaned up. And I'll uh, do the other one. Alright, got the other one off. It was also hard as well. I had to use the breaker bar. Just take it all the way off. Almost to a point where it was just hanging on the edge. It was just so gunkified. I even took a brush to it and um, that did not help. Uh, so, here we go. Um, up before you can see where it was before in position so um, just got to make sure you do your research and figure out the height of the bumper and now that